Hey guys, um, a short video where we're going to talk about um, wrists, wrist pain, wrist mobility, wrist flexibility. Uh, at Fitstrong here we spend quite a bit of time working on uh, various forms of crawling um, or other activities where our hands are, are on the floor um, with the wrist in a bit of extension. For some people who might work by a desk during the day or just don't move the wrist that much, that can be quite compromising, can be a bit uncomfortable. Um, so some of the warming up uh, tools you can, you can incorporate um, are indeed mobilizing your wrists. Um, so here's a very quick routine you can do. Now we only do rocking as part of warming up here, but during the rocking, let me turn to the side, you really pull your hand back. Now you do two hands, but you might find your balance is compromised. So you can definitely work on uh, one hand at a time. Now while you're doing any of these mobility drills, you want to work on pressing your hand into the floor, not just resting your hand on the floor, physically pressing it in. Do keep the pips with the elbow pointing forward um, and you work a, a variety of um, a variety of directions. So apart from fingers pointing forward, uh, it's wise to also get the fingers pointing back as well and doing some rocks there. You can take smaller rocking movements, gradually build those up. Again, pressing the whole hand into the floor. Um, you can incorporate some circular movements because we do some movements uh, strength moves where we do need uh, 3D control of our wrists. Um, so you have some lateral sideways walking. Okay, again, pressing with hands into the floor. Um, fingers. If you see my fingers there, it's kind of a bit closer. So pushing the floor away. So we're keeping our fingers in this extended position. Side to side, forward and back, all those different directions. Go hunting for tight spots and just uh, ease them out. They also get onto the back of the hand. Okay, it's a bit challenging for some people. But I start by turning, by rotating the forearm. I'm also trying to press my the back of my fingers into the floor, the back of my thumb into the floor, and then get into a little bit of rocking. I don't do two hands at a time, I like to do one hand at a time, so I have a bit of safety built in. Okay, don't force it. Once you come out of any positions, you might feel a bit tender in the hands, so I like to just make a couple of fists just to kind of reset uh, everything in, in, in the grip of the fist and fingers. Um, so other things you can do as well, you can work on your thumb mobility by prying your thumb open from the palm, uh, making some circles to try and loosen those things up. But whatever the case is, include some wrist mobility into your uh, routine. Cheers.